Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream job is to become a data analyst or a data scientist, then cracking the SQL interview is a very important role for attaining for uh, for attaining your dream job role. So for that, myself MLU Prasad, I'm a mentor for data science and analytics. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in top companies which are available at LeadCode platform. All my code solutions for the questions available in LeadCode platform are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the chart description below. And also, I have segregated the channel into 5 playlists which are easy, medium, hard depending upon the hardness of the question and the premium level question into premium playlist and all ordered questions uh, ordered by the respective IDs into one single playlist. Let's see the question which I am trying to solve it today. The question which I am trying to solve it today is type medium question number 0626 exchange sheets. Let's see the question. It is asked in Amazon for entry level question. Okay. Write an SQL query to swap the seat ID of every two consecutive seats. If the number of students is odd, then the uh, last okay, then the ID of the last student is not swapped. Okay, I will tell you what is that. See what they are trailing is one should be switched with two. Get it? Three should be switched with four. Okay. And five should be left alone. This case occurs only when it is an odd number. What they are saying is exchange one, two with two, three with four. But five, just leave it. Let's say 6 is there, then we need to exchange 5 with 6, 6 with 5. So, here the condition is not required. Okay. Let's see this special condition later. Let's try to convert this 1 to 2 and uh, this to that later. From seat, what they said, select id, comma case when Uh, ID is a odd number. See, odd number means 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, sorry, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. Okay. All the numbers which are divisible by 2 are called even numbers. All the numbers which are not divisible by 2 is called odd numbers. If you see, if you divide all the even numbers by 2, you will get remainder as 0. If you divide all the uh, odd numbers by 2, you will get the remainder as what? 1. That is what I am doing. I am checking if the id is a odd number. Then id plus uh, 1 minute. 1 minute. Okay, if you see. If it is a odd number, we should add one. If it is a even number, we do we need to remove one. So it is odd number, then what I will do? I will add one to the then id plus one. If it is not a odd number, then id minus one. end it let's call it some student okay sorry this should be the this should be this thing this should be called id comma student let's run it If you see what happened and they want in which order they want by ascending order id order by id ascend. 
if you see 1 became 2 2 became 1 exactly 3 became 4 4 became 3 exactly and 5 became 6 because by this logic but what should happen if it is the only one single thing then it should not be changed the simple trick is if it is a odd number and if it is a maximum number don't change it see if you see we are changing only odd numbers where it is not a maximum thing so I will just check for this condition first I will write one more condition case when id percentage 2 is equal to 1 and id in let's take the maximum of what is the maximum id maximum id from seat what will be the maximum id from seat 5 what i am saying if it is an odd number and also it is a maximum number then keep it id only okay our solution has been accepted i will explain once again what I am telling is leave this special condition where it is odd all the even numbers should be changed to odd numbers even numbers should be changed to, so even numbers to odd numbers and the odd numbers should be changed to even numbers but one special condition that if it is an even num if it is an odd number and it's also the maximum number from the seating table just keep it like this that ID only in the all other case exchange them that is what we are doing here I hope you got it Thanks for watching my video. If you want more detailed explanations like this with code examples written, just subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends who are uh, share it to friends who are preparing for a data analyst or a data scientist interview. Just be disciplined, complete all the 230 questions which are there in this platform. One day you will achieve your dream job role of data analyst or a data scientist. Thank you very much for watching it.